Trying to prevent me from making the grips, okay? So I'm moving around, I can fake like a double leg, I can make the collar, I'm it, boom, I'm in the collar. See, I went for the sleeve, she kind of blocked it, she opened the collar, then I grabbed it. The idea here is that if I'm late, and he's about to pull me, and I don't want to go on top because his guard is too good, I will sit, okay? And then whoever comes up first wins, okay? So if I'm here, all right? And then Professor goes and pulls guard. I sit with him, all right? And I want him to come up, I'm gonna be leaning back. Once he comes up, what I want is to make sure I have good position. What is good position here? Feet on the inside of his leg, at least, okay? So what I want you guys to work towards is, as they're coming up, I'm gonna give you about 15 seconds to work either a sweep, okay? Or close the guard. Sweep, or you close the guard, okay? So I'm here, Professor pulls guard, boom, I came up, he comes up, I get him in close guard, I'm on a safe position, okay? In regards to dealing with the open guard when you have no grips, which is actually very common, okay? One of the main uh, preference that you can have is the inside space between her feet, okay? I have to be in control of that, all right? What I don't want is her to be on the inside. I also don't want her to be on the outside. That's obvious, right? But we, sometimes we don't think about it, we make that mistake. Okay? I have to be on the inside, okay? That's one thing. Most people, when they move, they'll have to establish one leg forward, one leg back. That's not a, uh, uh, an aggressive fighting stance. She's being defensive on that position. Look, so how she stepped the leg forward already, okay? So what I wanna do when she does that is, I wanna mirror her position, okay? So I'm gonna be here, always keeping my feet on the inside, okay? Then, as we're moving around, my goal is to go shoot to shoot, okay? Bring her leg to me, leaning back, kicking the leg up, and then I go right back to that position we want to see. The one leg out, okay? If you guys want to adjust, get the boot, it's all fine. Let's not get to X yet, okay? So, the drill is going to be like this. Your partner is going to stand on an even stance. Make sure your feet is on the inside. Your partner's gonna pick a side to step back. Good. I'm gonna mirror it. Notice my position here, okay? Then, I'm gonna slide forward, so I go shift to shift. Then this hand, I'm gonna give a hug right behind her knee. So there is tension there, removing the slack. She's gonna try to pull the leg out of here. I don't let it. Look, I'm lifting my chin up and pulling to me. At the same, side, at the same time, I let my head fall away. Extend the leg, knee up, so she doesn't mount me. Go ahead and entangle your leg. Get a nice grip here on one leg out, all right? And then you guys get comfortable and you can start playing. Okay, so coach is trying to step in between my legs. I'm always on the inside. Oh, I can hear. Get in this position, go back. Always finishing on this position here, okay? From here, he steps on the inside of my leg. The first guard pass that they would typically go for is a knee slice. Okay. A great strong So that's what the person on top is gonna be doing. Person on the bottom, fighting for that shape to shape position. Let me just give you some references that some of you are missing there. Shin to shin, yeah, you guys all got it. You know, your foot is on the inside, you go shin to shin. Your knee needs to be on the outside of your elbow. And if your knee's on the inside, and he does, he's gonna, swap, he's gonna smash your knees together, and you lose control. Here, try to knee cut now, right? All right, lift it up. Pretty locked in this position. Notice how my knee is on the outside of my leg. Yeah? And then, it's not about falling back, it's about falling in, look, and rotating. And then finally, you kick the leg up, and you hug, so watch. Here, I go shin to shin, grab behind the partner's knee, establish good control, okay? And try to kick his foot out. The more his foot opens, the better. 
By the time you fall on your back, both of your knees are on the same position. You keep pulling the leg in, okay? And then you kick the outside leg up. <laughs> Why you keep the inside leg on that position? And you have feet. And I don't stay square like this. I'm gonna be here, okay? Just because it's a more mobile position for me, okay? And then professor starts to come to me. I'm gonna put my shin right close to his shin and I'm gonna hug his leg, okay? Now professor is strapped into the trap that I set up for him. I was just waiting for him to come. This is called the shin to shin, okay? It's a great entry to one leg X in the X guard, okay? So I'm here, make sure you keep it nice and tight. Notice how my knees on the outside of my elbow here. Let's turn around. Now watch this. Watch how I'm gonna move into a much better position. I'm gonna bring my head towards the other foot, rotate in while I kick his foot out. The professor has to put his hand on the ground so he doesn't lose balance, okay? And then what do I do? Both knees on my chest, the outer leg I'm gonna kick and I'm gonna hug it. <laughs> okay? It's actually not what happens most of the times. It can be aggressive too. So I was doing the drill with Bray. I was here trying to find my time. She started to come to me. So all of a sudden I'm like, what am I gonna do? Right? And then I said, well, she's coming this way, so let me try to switch. But when I switched, she was already ready, so I stepped in. She brought this one in, and she hold. She, she held. Come up, I can go for a foot walk. Okay? So, I'm gonna be here. All right, I'm sitting. Then I go after him. My feet is on the inside. I'm doing correctly. I hug. I rotate in. And I get to one leg X. Okay? Then from here. The sweep is gonna be by pressing my elbow in so his foot doesn't move. My hips gonna go up against his calf, his calf, and then I rotate my knees out. It's gonna make him fall. Okay? Now I have two options. I like option one better because I like to consolidate my knees. So I go up, so I do this, I got my sweep, two be two points. If you guys wanna go for a submission. Let's take a look at the foot up the, the foot lock here. Okay? You're gonna wrap it. Grab your own gi. Okay? Tuck your elbow. Okay. Then the inside leg is gonna come out and you're gonna start rotating outwards.